Hello and welcome on to this story. My name is Peter Heron. This story, we're just going to see how we can be able to convert add to cart button to call to, cart, call to order button for a specific product. This is the tutorial for today and what to, this is what you're going to achieve in today's tutorial. Like for this product, you can see it has a call to order button and whenever you just click call to order button, it just it will just a pop up for you to select uh, the call app, uh, the call app we just pop up and when you just click just select the call if you if you if you are using phone if you are using phone it just call directly this is on the shop this is on shop page and on archive page and when you just go to single product page you see the product was in the card but when i activated the code you see it just removed uh the code you cannot be able to purchase this product because it's not uh purchasable so it has this call to order button. That's the tutorial for today. Let me let dive in and I show you how to do it. So the first thing you just need to do, you need to head over to the dashboard and on the dashboard menu, you need to head over to the plugin on the plugin button. We, when you hover on it, we have these three options. Select the second option because you just need to install a plugin that will facilitate for us to be able to add the code. If you if you are well aware of how to add the code using function.php, you can uh, add group. Uh, function.php but I like using code snippet plugin it's so easy to edit and uh, when you want to upgrade your code so easy so I use code snippet here we have it I have already installed and activated it I include the link on the description if you have any issue on installing the plugin then from there we head over to the uh, when you just install and activate it on the dashboard menu, you have now button for snippet. Head over here and select a new. We need to add a snippet. Uh, just give it a name, maybe something like call to order. It's always good to give a name that is it's easy for you to know who this guy, uh, this code would work. So once you, once you give it a name, you just need to head over, use the link of the description to get the code. I have already done the, uh, the tutorial. I have a lot of many articles in my website. You can check on them. So here you have it. Just click on this button. <coughs> it will just check uh, all the code. And when you just check on, click on this button, just highlight and copy the code. Head over back here, paste your code here. Yeah, it's about 172 lines of PHP. Once you've done it, save and activate it. Once you've done it, you head over to any product. Once you open on any product here on these tabs here, you have now. Once you refresh, you will have a new tab here. Yeah, here we have it. The tab is called call to order and on click on call to order you have this checkbox. You need to add to check this checkbox and add your number. I have already added the number, then remember to update. Once you've done that, you refresh on the single product uh, page. You see it just changes the call uh the add to cart button to call to order and on shop page once you refresh here you see it just shows this product is for call to order you can do it for specific product without more hesitation it's so easy to do it that's the tutorial for today i hope you didn't learn something out of this story if you didn't learn something out of this story hit the thumbs up share and remember to comment if you have any issue till next time thank you